When the tide of war turned against the Tau, they faced attack in their stronghold in the city of Asharis, renamed Tarshan by the aliens. The aliens were well entrenched, however, and ready to mount a vigorous defense. Shas Okais, the Tau military leader, made his headquarters in a mighty citadel in the city's center, forcing attackers to wend their way through the tight city streets exposed to sniper fire and ambushes. Outlying bases in different quarters of the city supported his strategy, with crude warriors and powerful armored units harassing attackers even further. The Tau's only strategic vulnerability was Unity Plaza, the city's main public space. A sophisticated communications tower there could potentially be used by an attacker to expose the stealth units positioned across the city. Okais knew, however, that his attacker's ultimate objective would be assassination, not conquest. Onel Shores, a member of the mysterious ethereal caste, led the Tau forces from the citadel in Tashin. Were he to die, Tau forces would crumble, but as long as the Ethereal lived, the Tau would defend Tashin against all comers. Okais, are the troops ready? Yes, Arnel. The Earthcast is completing construction of the Montcar Command Post. Our armored units are ready to deliver the killing blow. And our Kroot allies? Also ready, Arnel. The Kayun Command Post in the city's Kroot Quarter is prepared, and the Shapers have readied the finest of their warriors. are taking position across the city, ready to strike where the enemy is weak. from our 
city and from our world. Today, more than ever before, we fight for the greater good and we will triumph! Return to the graves that spawned you, monsters! Gladly, but first we must help you to yours. The Kion post is safe in the crew quarter. We will defend it, Commander. Excellent. Send strike teams at the enemy, but protect your positions. Good! 